सो गईज वो सो वॉज गोइंग ऑन टुडे इन दिस वीडियो हम को ना शेयर ए सोल्यूशन फॉर दिस इशू दिस ब्रदर्स कमेंटेड हेलो आई हैव दी राइट गेम्स प्रॉब्लम सॉरी वी हैव वी हैविंग ट्रबल साइनिंग यू इन राइट नाउ आई एम जस्ट ट्राई इट ऑल इन दिस वीडियो बट डज नाट वर्क इट कैन यू प्लीज कैन यू हेल्प मी प्लीज सो बेसिकली दैट्स दी डी एन एस इशू or maybe some other sort we will discuss all the issues in this video uh actually solutions in this video so <clears throat> what you can do here the first thing is in my case my right client is working fine as you can see over here but mostly when you are using any vpn or proxy uh after closing those vpn or proxy is still working on the background so what you can do here first confirm that your vpn is disconnected properly for that just right click on your network icon open network and internet once you are here you will see here the internet properties if you are using wi-fi you will see here the wi-fi and then properties just go into it and then scroll down a bit you will see here the ip setting right now it's uh, ip assignment on automatic dhcp just click on that and make sure always select here the automatic dhcp maybe you are seeing here any proxy or manual settings so you need to set it back on automatic dhcp that's the first step the second step just go back once again and this time you will see here the change adopter options just go into it and then again double tap on it go into the properties and this time you will see here the ipv4 version just go into the properties and make sure select here obtain an ip address automatically obtain dns server addresses automatically just check these options and also automatically private ip address automatic just that's it these are the default setting for your operating system but still few proxies are running into the internet options you can disable it go into the internet options once you are here make sure clear all these temporary catches or junk files also go into the settings and make sure select here never and then click on ok once you have done this go into the connection make sure there's uh, there's no dial up if there is select that option and click on the remove and then go into the local area network lan settings and select here the automatically detect settings right and then click on okay hit apply okay now your internet is uh, internet configuration is perfectly fine now the next step is you can do here one more thing uh, sorry just click on this icon go into the windows security if you are not seeing here the icon you can search here the windows security right and then open it once you open this you need to go here into the firewall and network protection and then you will see here the private network which is activated in my case but maybe you are using right now the public network just find the activate front of the uh, network okay firewall network now in my case it's private if this is uh, unchecked you need to check it but for trying you can just disable it like this and then click on yes and then try it out might be this will solve your issue but if still you are facing you can re-enable it and now this time what we are going to do here we will go back go into the firewall and network setting once again allow an app through the firewall right now find here your valorant file if it's available now you can see we are using the private network so it's check but maybe in your case you are using the public but it's unchecked you so you need to check both just click on the change settings and then check for both right and that's it but in case if you are not seeing here the valorant file then you can allow another app and then click on browse then the driver where you have installed the right games in my case i'm using a d but by default location is c drive where you have the operating system just find the valorant folder go into it go into the live and add this valorant folder just click on open it will add the valorant for you after adding just uh, check both options for valorant private and public and then hit ok and that's it now your firewall is perfectly fine as well now the second uh, last step you can do here actually it's not last but uh, what you can do here you need to uh, run the cmd command prompt right now there's two options let me show you this is the cmd right if you launch it 
just pause i just launch this cmd add as an administrator just searching here cmd right click on it and i just click here run as administrator and this cmd will pop up so sometimes some misconfiguration make this issue wait let me show you let's go into the c drive windows system 32 open it find here the cmd cmd.exe and then right click on it and then launch it now just uh, let me know have you noticed any difference between both of course see c users and then austin test without administrator and this one is c windows system 32 there's a difference so sometimes misconfigurations make difference when you launch your cmd from here by uh, administratorly still it's launching as a user so we need to launch it as an administrator and the administrator will give you the windows and then system 32 once you get this one now you need to type here few commands ipconfig slash release this will disconnect your internet and then again ipconfig slash renew your internet will be back now again ipconfig oh wait it's not typing okay ipconfig slash flush dns and hit enter this will clear your dns and again ipconfig slash register dns and hit enter and then type exit and hit enter so it will uh, exit the cmd so after doing these steps your problem should be fixed but still if you are facing then hold windows plus r key and you will see here a run dialog box in which you need to type percentage local app data percentage and then click on ok now find here the valorant folder and right click on it click on delete once you click on delete go into the recycle bin and click on the empty recycle bin click on yes after doing these things guys your problem should be fixed 100% simply now you need to restart your pc also if it's possible restart your router so your ip address will be renewed per, uh, perfectly and that's it your problem should be fixed after applying all these methods if still you are facing then let me know but hopefully your problem should be fixed but in case if you are facing then you need to uninstall the riot vanguard just right click on uh, your vanguard icon then more and then uninstall vanguard this will pop up a notification box just click on yes and after uninstalling just restart your valorant and then launch the riot client sorry restart your pc and then launch the riot client this will reinstall the vanguard and your problem will be fixed 100 percent if you have any other question please let me know in the comment section until then just take yourself allah face bye bye